deserve to stay here. But as the Danish manager said, I'm not sure whether I can trust them on my players. They might contrive the result. And here comes the chance for Sieverbeck. Manchester United, John Sieverbeck roaring through from the back. And on the target, just deflected by Furster. Soren Lerby. Laudrup. Anderson taking his marking role for the moment. Soren Lerby. Oh, great shot and a good save, but it was just as well. First, it was there to pick up. And the Danes have obviously got the rhythm. Or perhaps, do they not want to? But certainly, Frank Arneson does here as he gets forward powerfully. And here's Laudrup. The flag is up for offside. It won't count. This protest from Arneson. That was a bit unfortunate. Laudrup was offside at that, but also is robbed there rather naively. It's followed to Alofs. Alofs is in a good position here. Alofs, great save, and Foller hits the rebound first time over the bar. The Germans were in with a real chance there. The quick break, Klaus Alofs, terrific save by her, and the rebound flies wide. Looking for Herget. There's Berthold, he's in a good position. Oh, great save again. Well, Lars Hur started this campaign as the third choice goalkeeper. I think he's going to end up as the first choice. Oh, by Heget. Good ball. Nicely picked up by Bremer. Rolf has gone forward. Bremer can hit them. Oh, hit the ball. What a shot from Andreas Bremer. Picked up by Berthold. Desperate bad luck by the West German fullback. And that blew through the high altitude there here. Bremer's shot. Goalkeeper didn't see it. Danes come again with Frank Arneson. Had a couple of bursts in the last few minutes. Arneson going very well. Arneson goes down. Surely that's in the area. Surely that's a penalty. Jakobs puts one forward to Rudy Voller with Brust. Rudy Voller. Put it back well for Matthews. Matthews going again. The goalkeeper saved Denmark yet again, but he was a bit fortunate when Matthews' shot came out again. And it was flicked at just wide. Olsen. Olsen still coming. Gordon Olsen driving into the air. He goes down. It's a penalty. The Danish captain's run from the back has earned them a penalty two minutes before the half-time break. 36-year-old legs, but he kept going pretty powerfully there. And the Belgian referee had no hesitancy in popping it onto the spot. And it looks as if it's going to be Jasper Olsen with the kick against Schumacher. Here's Olsen. So smooth. Manchester United Jesper Olsen sends the Danish fans into ecstasy with a cool penalty just before the half-time break. Matthäus helping him here. Jesper Olsen takes it away, but then loses it to Berthold, making a positive run forward. Berthold still with it. Litbarski getting up. Does well! Litbarski from an impossible angle almost rolled one into the net. Goalkeeper was struggling here. The first time hers made a mistake, but Klaus Alaps on his left is Bremer. Room now for Heger. 
Oh, a lot of rub now for Mateus. Mateus denied by brilliant goalkeeping by Lars Hur. Round in midfield. Surely there's going to be more goals here. Here comes Jan Molby. On the right is Frank Arneson, and they're wide open with Ericsson getting in the middle. John Ericsson, the second for Denmark. Well, Arneson did the spade work. Ericsson, the substitute, pokes it in. But such wide open spaces for the Danes to exploit. Of course, the Germans were down to 10 men at this stage. There's no Furster, but there's no cover either. From Anderson here. Anderson dashing forward. Anderson might go for one himself. Looking for the quick return from Ericsson. Ericsson shoots. Just wide. He's enjoying this taste of first team football. The Feyenoord leading scorer. That wasn't so far past the post. Being told having a backtrack. In for Lipowski. Nice little dodge. The shot. Oh, that was cleverly done by Pierre Lipowski. Perfect control, dodging away from the tackle, and a pretty good shot. Edir. Forward to Rumidiga. Rumidiga, great turn. Another good save by Lars Hur. Come out and close it all down so fast. Oh, there's problems here. Certainly dramas on the ground. Now, there's going to be trouble for Arneson because he's already had one yellow card. If he gets another yellow card, he's gone, and I'm afraid he is. How absolutely unnecessary. Apologies to Mateus. Totally unnecessary. Mateus and Arnes flash. There's a bit of stupidity there, but Mateus makes rather more of it than he should have done. the final whistle the referee involved in a little bit of controversy in a game which has been comfortably won by the Danes when he sends off Frank Arneson but he really couldn't do any more Lothar Matthaus the Bayern Munich midfield player will might feel that he made rather too much of that but in the end a comfortable winning style for the Danes